Welcome to After Dark from the Den. We are here with Curl. <laughs> and uh, we'll just get right into it. Uh, just introduce the, the band and the, the name of the song and uh, just, you know, how you, how you guys met. For sure. Uh, so that's Jerry on bass, Katie back there on drums, TJ on lead guitar, and uh, I'm Gunner, and I play rhythm guitar and sing. And uh, we met sort of weirdly uh, all like five years ago to a degree, yeah. like through yeah, house, house party scenes, I guess. Yeah. And uh, Jerry played in a band, I played in a band, Katie played in a band, TJ played in a band, and uh, we just ended up coming together. We just broke up those bands to be together because we love the same singers. Yeah, <laughs> we, we broke them all up. <laughs> but um, this first song's called Inner Exit. Heck yeah. <laughs> that was awesome. That was really cool. <laughs> so uh, I was trying to 
uh, listened to some stuff that you've you've kind of put up on uh, YouTube on the way out here. So I didn't really know what to expect because I've I've seen you guys play uh, maybe like once or twice, like once at Andy's. But um, something that uh, I wanted to definitely ask you was uh, if the the post punk. Um, kind of like a new wave scene is your inspiration if that's where you kind of gather because i listened to some of the stuff that you uh did in midnight social club uh and kind of reminded me of that a little bit <laughs> yeah we like we like post-punk that stuff's cool um i'm more into like brian eno and like sesame street songs and <laughs> kinda that kind of stuff you know <laughs> Grateful Dead, I think that's a big influence. Uh, no. Brandy, Alicia Keys, Sade, Sade, uh, D'Angelo. Oh, D'Angelo, uh, man. Yeah, J pre pre Blueprint three Jay Z pre, pre Kanye Jay Z. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I don't know, man. I don't want to like just name it all off, because uh, then. You know, well, I know hanging out makes it with too easy, you, you know? Yeah, well, I know hanging out with you, uh, you've always introduced me to music I've never heard of, so I was going to see if there were some bands that I probably haven't even heard of that was like an inspiration for this project. More of this sound. Uh, what's that one band? Huh? Little Beaver. Little Beaver? They're pretty Little good. Little Beaver. What's that? Uh, dry Cleaning? Dry Those motherfuckers, they're pretty dope. Dry Cleaning. Uh, can you even never heard of that <laughs> when they're not talking into the mic? Uh, yeah. Uh, if you want to hop up there, TJ, oh, you can just talk into that. Yeah. <laughs> this is weird. So, Little Beaver and Dry Cleaning. Yeah, Dry Cleaning is a pretty cool band from the UK. Uh, we like huh. them. Little Beaver is this old uh, black bass player who was a oh, session man. musician oh, who just uh, dropped dropped this whole crazy album. Really, just like a solo it. album? Or? Uh, Huh. That's cool. He had the greatest outfits I've ever seen. It was like Frankie Beverly and Mays on crack. <laughs> it was insane. It was like pleather. It looked like, uh, what is it, the village people? Yeah. yeah. It looked sort of like that. It was really cool. Yeah, I'm here for it. <laughs> awesome. What about you, Katie? Is there anything in particular, like drumming style? Oh. You <laughs> I you watch this dive on TV. Um, <laughs> uh, hmm. I don't know. Uh, my, I used to definitely play front to back like Radiohead albums, so that's like. Oh yeah, Radiohead. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's a good one. My biggest inspo. Um, which one's also, your favorite? Huh? Which one's your favorite? Like which Radiohead album? In Rainbows, front to back. In Rainbows, oh, yeah. Yeah. I used to play too. yeah. Um. Oh, Beethoven. But I definitely got hella inspired by the drummer from Hill Earl when I. Came to so. Hmm. Shout out. Oh, yeah, shout yeah out. they're they're a great <laughs> band. <laughs> shout out for. Uh, her. Coming for you. Hadn't Damn played man. drums in like a year, and I saw them, and I was like, mm, I have to play drums again. So, did so. you play drums before uh, before coming out to Denton? You like grew up playing music, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I was in marching band, drum line, and everything. Um, That's badass. Since middle school, yeah. <laughs> yeah it was fun. Uh. Where did you move from? Grapevine College. Grapevine, okay. You were you were kind of from the Dallas area, right, Jerry? Yeah, I was from like Oak Cliff, South Yeah. Well, oh, you're from Dallas too. Yeah. We're oh, okay, cool. What about you, TJ? Are you from around here? Uh, I was born in Florida. Really? Yeah. Florida, Florida man. Florida man. Florida man. Florida man. Florida man. All right, well, Gunner, you want to introduce the next song? Yeah, the next one's called Star. We were just in the studio recording this uh, this weekend, so. Cool. Let's do it. Thank you. 
song that's cool <laughs> i dig it so you uh so you're recording huh yeah. are we doing uh you guys doing a full album or is it uh an ep oh so it's, it's like a it's gonna be like a single release like a okay yeah. cool oh yeah I was just talking loud, so maybe you could catch everything I was saying. <laughs> uh, we're just gonna, you know, let Spotify call it an EP for us. And whatever Bandcamp wants to do, they'll do that. And whatever SoundCloud wants to do, they'll do that. Album music. <laughs> Title. Title. I like uh, I like the hair ch the hair color change. I notice you like to do that quite pretty frequently. <laughs> Is that your hair? Come, come through, right? I used a picture, and it was like it was like 
purple or pink or something. It was cool. Oh, per- uh, yeah, I was way back for, for, the for the post. <laughs> <laughs> gotta keep it, gotta keep Dude, it. every it's now cool. and then I'll get like a, uh, I'll think about that. Like I'll get like a wild hair. Like you know what? It'd be kind of weird to just do blonde Bleach one day, it just like bleach it. Try it out <laughs> with the curls. Cool. It'd be yeah, weird. It <laughs> I've never thing. done it before, so. <laughs> Why not? Uh, I don't know. I really don't know. Yeah, you yeah, might you might yeah, hit the streets a little too hard with that. You do like fuchsia, like or like that purple his shirt. Something real yeah, mood. Relax, you know? Or you can be red. Yeah, it would be cool. I feel like if I did red, it would just look like carrot top, though. Like <laughs> 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 or Ronald McDonald. Right? <laughs> oh, especially because I got the little fro thing going on right now. Costume <laughs> idea. Hey, that's not a bad through, idea, right? honestly. <laughs> so you guys have any plans Halloween? You playing any uh, Halloween gigs? We got something in the works, cool, I think. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we might be playing a show the night before Halloween. Yeah. That would be cool. That'd be fun. I don't Dallas, know who it's with. Dallas. Oh, it's with, in Dallas somewhere. With um, Dalton's band. Oh, heck yeah. Oh wow! I haven't, I haven't even heard Dalton's name in yeah, so right. such a long time. Yeah, it's so the person, the guy that we're recording with, his name's Alex Bohr. Okay. That's awesome. Is Dal- is Dalton still playing in a in a band then? He's yeah. He just I guess he has a new project, like a solo project he's doing. Okay. He's like a full band he's playing with, and that's when they both realized they knew me or us was because Alex was going to see his band play at uh, yeah. Double White or something. That's cool. Yeah. So. Um, Pretty much everyone in this room then has been in the music scene for quite a while. Uh, I know you were uh, before Curl. You you had Midnight Social Club. Was there another project before that one that you were involved with? Yeah, there was. There, dude, I've been playing in Dallas band since I was like fourteen. But um, <laughs> we <laughs> before Curl, God, this is embarrassing. There was a band that we had. Shout out Joel. We had called the Robbers that lived for like a week in my house and we played funnily enough a halloween party at (laughs) at the old house that you went to and uh that's cool it was real cute it was very like (laughs) first first years and didn't like bright-eyed bushy tail type like let's put a show together kids yeah it was fun but uh dude their bands were much better i like i like everything you guys have been in you want to you want to talk about that too? Yeah, yeah. Talk about uh, talking about the gorgeous days. TJ, TJ has an amazing band called Astro James. That's true. Astro James. Astro James. Yeah. That's Astro. cool. Are you still like release stuff, or you still play with them? Astro James has a uh, rest in peace, Astro James. Oh. <laughs> hey, not, not the building. Not yet. Let's go. <laughs> it's on hiatus because. Cause so girl. like curl is like a goddess that we worship actually and we can talk about that more later off camera i don't want to freak you guys out <laughs> but curl's like a goddess that we worship and like you know like what you what you don't do for only what you do for christ will last so it's like only what you do for curl will last so we all like set aside our other things to focus on curl so that we can reap the benefits of her uh bountiful harvest and um get signed to sub pop and uh <laughs> play glass and bear in like two years so you just want to eat like really expensive French food Please. for Fashion Week. Please. Jay Z. Like, that's the only reason we're here right now. That's the dream, right? That's, that's, <laughs> it's going to be a reality. We don't believe in dreams. <laughs> well, it's good to, uh, good to know everyone in the band has goals yeah. <laughs> and the same goal, nonetheless. <laughs> so, uh, if you want to just introduce the next song, we yeah. can go into it. Yeah. Let's do something called Sundown Town. Uh, yeah, I recommend for anybody who doesn't know what that is, maybe look it up. We'll figure out something.
Whoever's never enough Taking my pain It's too much, it's too much I can't hang it from the poplars Cut my neck, she's numb And it still feels like Oh, I might make it out again good so for all the people at home clap along and while we forever forever's never enough and while we forever forever's never enough Huawei forever, forever's never enough, and I'm still backed up in the car, with my mind too fucked up, with my mind too fucked up, with my mind! Hair ties don't work with our set. <laughs> so, um, is there uh, is there a set of bands or uh, or like groups of uh, you know people behind the scenes that? Uh, you, you guys like playing and or working with uh, at the moment and uh, do you have any plans of like going on a tour or um, you know playing outside of DFW well yes <laughs> I guess I'll speak uh, can someone else want to speak um, for the first question I guess I mean my favorite person right now is Alex Has he been a sound engineer for a while? Have it, have you, yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, I've never I've never met him. How'd you meet him? Um <laughs> yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> Magic of DMs. <laughs> cool. Uh, what's the name of the, the studio that he runs? Uh, Elmwood Studio? Oh, okay. Cool. A little bit, but that's all right. I don't have the headphones like they do. Are there any bands that you like playing with that you'll probably play with again more? Yeah. Sly Fun Guy. Sly Fun Guy, yeah. Shout out the homies Dust Mothers. Shout out Sarakaya. Sarakaya. Uh, what, what's, what's some other bands we really... We like Sub-Sahara. Always oh. love playing with them. Nice. Um, Oh, oh thyroid. thyroid. Shout out Thyroid. Thyroids. Oh, yeah. Dude, yeah. they they invited us on a crazy show. Like, huh. it's really cool. That's awesome. Who else do we need to put on right quick? Uh, <laughs> shout out Zeke Forever. Oh, Zeke Forever. <laughs> like, the day one. Ever heard of Possible? Yeah. Zeke Forever. Zeke Forever. Uh, Forever. Shout out the young homies, Nimi Sexual. Oh, Nimi. Going crazy. Great kids. Huh. Everybody else is afraid of us, and they don't talk to us at shows. So. One more. King Clam. <laughs> Shout out King oh, Clam. Song too. Fuck yeah, King Clam. Love King Clam. Oh, King Clam. Uh, wow. Dallas I haven't own. heard of them in a long time. Dude. I'm, I'm surprised they're still doing stuff. Dude, they're still they're going, going, going crazy. Really? Yeah, it's called Roswell. It's great. Cool. Yeah, wow. That they're band's good. been around they're since, good. like, what, 2017, 2018? Nah. Something like that? I, thought they were new. I think they're pretty new. They've they're been like, around since... Yeah, they started really? during like COVID-ish time. Oh, okay. Maybe I'm thinking of another band that had King in the name. It's, it might be. Oh, you know what? I think I might be thinking of King Country. King yeah, Country. I know. Yeah, King yeah. Country. Yeah, yeah they said. <laughs> yeah, I think some of them are in Austin now. But uh, if anyways, I don't Shout know. Out, it's been a while. Oh, hey, Luna. 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 Oh, you know, um, they're playing with Omar, uh, Omar Apollo, right? Yeah, yeah. I uh, so I saw Luna Luna at Happy House at Gabe's house yeah. party. Yeah, and man, whenever they played there, it was packed. Yeah, it was dude. They had like just released a music video too, so it was. Oh like, yeah, I, I, was, I was the star of that music video. Oh, were you were in the? Oh, no, just okay. Kidding. I was literally in one. <laughs> well, uh, are, you talk, are you talking about like the the prom setting? Yeah. Like okay, yeah, that was a cool music video. Do you guys have any uh, music video ide- ideas yet? Uh, yeah, yeah. We're yeah. About to, uh, go super hard. We should have like a song out, if not by the end of this year, by um, early next year. Uh, which song? Uh, the one we're about to play for you right now. Oh. Don't want to hype it up or anything, but it's pretty fucking good. <laughs> um, <laughs> Yeah, Star, the album um, we played earlier. Uh, but we'll have a couple songs released, and we should have like a whole marketing plan and like videos, yeah, photos, like pop ups, merch, merch, stickers, stickers and events, yeah. campaigns, yard signs, We're taking to the campaign route, dance, parties. dance parties, a whole bunch of parties. <laughs> oh, yeah, and a tour, yeah. Maybe like next summer. Right. When when gas yeah. prices sell down when, in other when, states, when gas right? Go down. <laughs> uh, well, cool. Well, uh, what's right. the name of this song again? Uh, this is called Modern English. Oh, all right. <laughs> Shout out DJ Cheryl Waters. Michael, you're over there walking in her footsteps like a true G over there. We love you, baby. Thanks for inviting us. <laughs> of course, Jerry. It's a change of the tide. It's the counting of the clock. He moves it and recounts all the dots. So why did he skyline with the glass ceiling top? 
wait for the moment why you want it to stop just to refresh you that's the symptom of one use our favorite escape goats see if they'll prop see for nothing see from the have nots just a Monday realm of modern English all the gods I wonder all the time if you live to a something to find Red and blue, shot like stars, oh God, what you are Tonight that my brother and I You often want to do, I guess you know the rules Something that I'm not Modern English, yeah, it's all that I got She was the moment, only for the night. Get around, I was getting way too high. Cop pulled me over on 75. Catching your life, you really might just fly. It was never enough, who niggas in the side. Never the truth, and angels never die. Calling your bluff, I guess I'm calling nine. Lee enough, angel on my life. Only ever turn, I guess you know it burns. I dip and I dash, oh God, I was fun. The night that my brother and I. You often want to do, I guess you know the rules. Only to forever, God, I would never leave you never. It's only ever done it, never done it, no. Show, you say. All right. This was uh, After Dark from the Den. Thanks for tuning in.